everyone. I'm Emma from GoDaddy Show The Journey, and I'm joined today by my friend Darlene from GoDaddy's How To. And we want to talk with you today about adding delivery service options to your business. That's right, Emma. I know that I'm doing my part to stay home during the COVID-19 crisis, as are many others that don't have essential jobs. And using services like Uber Eats, DoorDash, and Grubhub are great ways to still get food delivered right to my door from my favorite restaurants. Yeah, so let's talk about delivery service. Each of these companies has their own business models. So you research to determine which option works best for you. Some things to consider are one, cost for you and your customers, two, delivery areas. So like how far do they deliver from your location? And thirdly, how user-friendly is the app or the website for you and your customer? Another thing you can do is check out other restaurants in your area and see what they're using. If you determine that everyone's using a specific service, that means that there may be more drivers in your area. Oh, and another thing to point out is that I've seen that a lot of these companies are offering different promotions right now to encourage customers to use their services. I know that I've taken advantage of them for sure. Me too, Darlene. Once you decide which company you want to use, you'll work with them to get things set up. And when your menu displays on their website or app, you can add links on your website, right, Darlene? That's right, Emma. Let me show you how to do that. We're going to start on Website Builder. There are a couple of different ways to show that you're now offering delivery. You can add the information to the header of your site or even call it out in a promotional banner. To update the header, all you need to do is click the text you want to update and make the change. I'm going to change my text to say, now offering delivery. When you click on the header, it opens that section over here on the right, so you can make any other changes to the image, accent color, or alignment. We're going to leave ours as is. Now let's update our call to action button. We'll click the button in our preview window and make the changes in the pane on the right. We're going to put order now on our button. Now we're going to link to the website URL of the delivery service where our menu displays. I'm going to paste in my URL and then click Done. Now, when people click the button, they'll jump over to the delivery company website with your restaurant displaying so they can place their order. If you want to add a promotional banner, you can do this by going to the promotional banner option in the header section, which is where we currently are. In this section, flip the toggle to show a promotion. Enter your custom message. We're gonna say, now offering delivery through Uber Eats. Now we wanna add the link to the external website URL. Click the toggle and paste in the link. Now click done. Let's go preview our site. We can see our header and promotional banner front and center, and they're both advertising that we're using a delivery service and both link to that site. Don't forget to publish if you like what you see. Thank you, Darlene. As always, you do such a great job of showing us how to do these things. I hope that more and more restaurants take advantage of delivery services during these times when we're all at home. And I know that I love seeing new restaurants pop up here in San Diego because I love to support small businesses. I hear you, Emma, and I feel the same way. I'm keeping my fingers crossed that my favorite local restaurant adds their delivery soon. So thanks for joining me today. Stay safe. My pleasure, Darlene. Stay healthy.